A reading of Paul's letter to the Corinthians. If I speak in the tongues of mortals and of angels, but do not have love, I am a noisy gong or a clanging cymbal. And if I have prophetic powers and understand all mysteries and all knowledge, and if I have all faith so as to remove mountains, but do not have love, I am nothing. If I give away all my possessions, and if I hand over my body so that I may boast, but do not have love, I gain nothing. Love is patient, love is kind, love is not envious or boastful or arrogant or rude. It does not insist on its own way. It is not irritable or resentful. It does not rejoice in wrongdoing, but rejoices in the truth. It bears all things, believes all things, hopes all things, endures all things. Love never ends. But as for the prophecies, they will come to an end. As for tongues, they will cease. As for knowledge, it will come to an end. For we know only in part, and we prophesy only in part. But when the complete comes, the partial will come to an end. When I was a child, I spoke like a child. I thought like a child. I reasoned like a child. When I became an adult, I put an end to childish ways. For now, we see in a mirror, dimly, but then we will see face to face. Now I know only in part, then I will know fully, even as I have been fully known. And now faith, hope, and love abide, these three, and the greatest of these is love. The word of the Lord. The warmth of a smile, the hug of an old friend, the generosity of a neighbor, or helping out when the party comes to an end. The world does no kindness, even in the smallest ways. If we take hands together, we pave the way for our happiest days. My religion is kindness, so let's spread love to all, grant forgiveness and understanding, and a helping hand when others fall. By doing this, I think we'll find that smiles are contagious, and so is being kind. Thank you. Thank you. Wow. <laughs> a New Hope by Maddie Stefani. I need a new hope, a new hope, a hope that reaches for the stars and that does not end in violence or war, a hope that makes peace on our earth and that does not create evil in the world, a hope that finds cures for all diseases and does not make people hurt in their bodies, in their hearts, or most of all, in their spirits. I need a hope, a new hope, a hope that inspires me to live and to make all these things happen so that the whole world can have a new hope too. Thanks. Nice. Thanks. Some acts of kindness performed by uh, the youth group uh, are holding the door for people, shoveling driveways for people, uh, helping people whose cars broke down, um, helping people with their homework, and holding the door for people even more. <laughs> helping people with their stuff if they have a broken leg or arm. Uh, uh, letting people sit down if they need to or like giving up your seat for them, holding the door for people, shoveling the driveway for your neighbors, uh, sharing a pencil, being a friend, and then talking to someone and inviting them to sit down. All right. <laughs> Kind hearts on the gardens, kind thoughts are the roots, kind words are the flowers, kind deeds are the fruits. Take care of your garden and keep out the weeds, fill it with sunshine, kind words and kind deeds. Henry Wordsworth Longfellow. And then, believe me, being kind to yourself, to strangers, to those you love, to the world. Every day, at every opportunity, you will make you you happier and more connected to everything and everyone than you have ever been. 
It will bring you peace. Bernadette Russell, The Little Book of Kindness. With so much negativity in out world, the most important thing is kindness towards others. Eldono Lewis Fernhands. Interesting enough, although kindness has a good chance of leading to success, kindness will always lead to happiness. So if you want to be happy, be kind. David T. Fagan. And then we can view the world in one of two ways. We can look at out and see all the negativity and heartache that occurs, or we can choose to focus on all the kindness and generosity to and draw from its strength. Michael, Michelle, to be an unexpected kindness. Before we share the Lord's Supper, uh, Peggy has a poem to share. The words are in your bulletin. And then Tyler and Jack have a few words to share. Kindness is hard to find. It's an uncut diamond in a mine. It's a jewel so valued by most. Where it's found, you find God the host. Walking in love comes easy for me. I love my fellow man. That's God's love, you see. He loves the ones that scorned him and hurt him. Chances that most people love like that are very slim. A smile isn't that hard to manage. A frown and a scowl can cause someone damage. There are none on earth who haven't felt pain, but with kindness, so much to gain. Acts of kindness. You can never show enough kindness to others. By Catherine Pulsifer. Kindness is the language with the deaf can hear and the blind can see by Mark Twain. My religious is simple. My religious is kindness by Dalai Lama. Great persons are able to do great kindness by Miguel de, de Severtes. Kindness gives birth to, to kindness, Sassafos. Sass Kindness can become its own motive. We are made kind by being kind, by Eric Hoffer. Have you had a kindness shown? Pass it on. T'was not given for the alone. Pass it on. Let it travel down the years. Let it wipe another's tears. Till in heaven the dead, the deed appears. Pass it on, by Henry Burton. I've always depended on the kindness of others by Tennessee Williams. We're here for a reason. I believe a bit of the reason is to throw little torches out to lead, little torches out to lead people through the dark by Whippy Goldberg. Do all the good you can by all the means you can, in all the ways you can, in all the places you can, at all the times you can, to all the people you can, as long as you ever can by John Wesley. The everyday kindness of the back roads more than make up the acts of greed in the headlines by Charles Curl. Treat everyone with politeness, even those who are rude to you, not because they are nice, but because you are. Authors unknown. For attractive lips, speak words of kindness by Aubrey Hepburn. We widely underestimate the power of the tiniest person's touch of kindness. Author unknown. Thank you.